that. Joyless is suggesting you vote for Trump, this is what you get. I was trying a pivot. You obviously didn't want to allow me to finish there. I, I would never say something like that. I think it's very important to te treat every voter with dignity and respect. It's not your fault, whatever district you live in, if something like this happens, you wouldn't say to the people who live in Flint, Michigan, that it's their no. fault that they ended up with bad water because they voted for Democrats. Um, and I think that the point would be a lot better taken. And I think there's validity to that point, as we know now about the regulations that were rolled back in 2017. We've seen the beginnings of the report from the NTSB. We do know that there were federal agents, officials on the ground at the beginning of this. Yes, Secretary Pete was late to get there, but that doesn't mean that the government had abandoned it, them. They wouldn't even declare it a national disaster. But right? Governor DeWine and Congressman Johnson, I believe that's his name, both said that they had gotten everything that they had asked for and that they didn't need anything else. This wasn't about a dereliction of duty on the part of the Biden administration.